Only thing I can promise you is I'm coming back to the next episode with so much anger and pain in my blood that it is a guaranteed win. I will see you in the most rage-induced shitstorm of an episode next episode. I'm gonna drop 28 on this dude's head. It's either gonna be a rage quit or he's gonna sit through a thrashing. For the cheapest and safest men 22 coins, go to MMOEXP.com and use code MMG for 5% off. Look at me. Look at me right in my eyes. Last episode literally made me contemplate quitting Madden. I typed in www.onlyfans.com. I was making a profile. I was ready to retire. I'm still thinking about it. If you have not seen episode number four of Wheel of Mutt, go watch it. What you will witness today is the gameplay of a man who is so fed up with electronic arts. Today, I'm guaranteeing you right now either a rage quit or a win by 21 or more. We're two and two to keep this team and potentially make it to the Super Bowl and Prestige someone else. You gotta make it all the way to the playoffs, baby. My body is running off of pure rage right now, like anger. Every time in my life, if I just need, if I gotta get out of bed, if I need a boost, if I need to get dialed in, if I need to be wired, all I have to do is go watch Wheel of Mutt episode number four, and all of the emotion will surge back to the surface, and I'll just wanna run through a brick wall. Wheel of Mutt episode number five will be a cheat clapping of the century because I'm so upset. Our first wheel spin. And you know what? This wheel spin is going to be a cracked 89 plus overall player. It doesn't matter. I know it's going to be. I'll do ultimate kickoff all over again, baby. We did not get to lock in last time, but we will get to lock in this time. Who do we get? We got Kevin Zeitler. I, I have a feeling we're going to get someone a little bit better this time. It's going to come from the Colts or the Chiefs, maybe. The Colts. You know, this might, this might be an offensive lineman too, huh? No idea. I would love a defensive player. It's Eric Fisher. It's literally last episode all over again. And if it, if it ends like last episode, I'm going to break something. All right, our first spin is a quick one. I'm just ready to get into the game, honestly. Mm. <laughs> Huge potential, but it implies that I have to know the player's college. So, first thing we do, we go into the auction house. Sort by overall, any of these players are up for grabs. Oh my god, super clutch start. Because these are Campus Legends, and I know these because I was just playing Campus Legends. I see we start KO. Reggie Bush, USC. However, I don't need Reggie Bush. Like, I for sure don't need Reggie Bush. Because I got Saquon. Brian Dawkins? Wait, what's his team? I want to say Miami, but I don't think it's Miami because Miami is Ed Reed. Is Ed Reed Ray Lewis? Is Brian Dawkins Clemson? I pray he's Clemson because this is the only player I want on this board. Are you Clemson? Yes! Brian Dawkins is from Clemson and I don't get to do any more thinking. I know that's who I want on this team. Brian Dawkins is a savage. We're going Avalanche, Brian Dawkins. And abilities wise, I should be able to get Deflator Enforcer, presumably. Oh, he's a zone safety? I'm surprised he's a zone safety. I guess we can go Acrobat instead. Really solid ability. All right, let's get these boys subbed in an 88 overall and a 90 overall. This is a must win. Let's do our challenge wheel. In the event we lose with the new challenge wheel rules, if you guys did not see last episode, we have new challenge wheel rules. I can either open the pack like we've always been doing upon completion, or if I lose, I can save a player. In this example, let's say I lose, but I complete my challenge wheel, I can save Brian Dawkins. Ken Lloyd, Marlon Humphrey, Saquon Barkley. Solid team. We're gonna have a pretty solid matchup here. All right, let's get our challenge wheel before this game starts. I don't wanna make the same mistake I made last game and spin it after. It might be no PATs. Honestly, no PATs is fine because I almost never do this anyway, so this isn't that bad. Under no circumstance can I kick a PAT. I think this is bench or it's a dive it is bench oh 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 inside zone no uh oh we might be playing someone who's pretty good i promise a rage quit i plan to get it let's go cover two man i'm gonna get on y he's gonna throw it i knew it i'm telling you you're rage quitting let's go another pick six for Devin White in back-to-back -back games. I'm getting that rage quick. I don't care how. Come on! Come on! Easy! Already! I promised you it, boys. That was way faster than I expected, though. Our first ever spin on the rage crew. Wow, it feel I have a huge weight lifted off my chest. Just actually getting a win after having such a tough last game. And Team Wheel 88-89 is actually incredible. Exactly what we need. So we can get any 88 to 89 overall player, which is gonna include the ultimate kickoffs. So we're doing a lot with ultimate kickoffs, but it must be a Ram. Oh my God, sit. Dude, I swear to God, there's an 88 overall Stafford. I don't actually know, but I swear to God there is. Stafford, Stafford, Stafford. Yes! 
88 overall, Matthew Stafford. And since it's 88 to 89, I can actually get the power up as well. Since that'll take him to an 89 overall. I'm so pumped. Let's go. Staff, I love you, baby. And we get that sexy ultimate kickoff card art with my favorite light blue on it. Oh, I'm going to go gambler. Faster passes that can't be picked off. Pocket dead eye. Although, honestly, I don't think I want anything else. Pass lead to lead is pretty good. But I've been throwing just fine. I don't want to mess with this. I love you. I'll see you in the next episode of Wheel of Mutt. Peace. <laughs> the episode is not over. Don't worry. <laughs> All right, now the way this works after a super quick rage quit, our players are locked in. We get one spin on the wheel and we play one more game. We're only gonna be fighting for one player, but I just can't end the episode off that early. So we're getting a little double time. I love to see it. All right, boys, so we get one spin on the wheel. This is the player we're fighting for in this next episode and we can still get the challenge wheel. Our challenge is Mutt Draft Phone a Friend. This is gonna be really interesting. The way this works, I can choose the Mutt Draft round, but I can't go back, okay? So let's say I get to round 10 and I really like the three players that I'm looking at. I have to select that round in the moment I see it. I can't go see all the rounds and then come back to it. So we're gonna find an awesome round. Then I'm gonna call one of my friends and they're gonna pick the player. All right, let's find a cracked round to work with here. That's pretty solid. I do need new linebackers, but I'm gonna gamble. I have a feeling I can find like an 88 or 89 safety in here somehow. Uh-oh, I might've made a mistake by going this deep. Need a big clutch. We need a big clutch. Hey! Oh God, we just gotta hope on this last round. Gilmore, Von Miller, Bosa, that's huge. All of those are amazing. Wait, dude, all of these are incredible, except for maybe Bosa, because I really don't want to take louder milk out. Let's call a friend up. I don't know if there's any credence to what I'm about to say, but I think whoever I list first, they probably won't select. I'm gonna call Shmaklepoo. She's from the Hawaii vlog. Schmuggle winner. Hi. Did I just wake you up? Uh, kind of. That's a yes. I'm so sorry. Uh, I need you to help me for a video, okay? Nick Bosa, Von Miller, or Stefan Gilmore? Von Miller. Let's fucking go! Thank you, Schmuggle winner. Let's go! I knew she'd clutch up, baby. I knew she wasn't gonna pick the first one. Nick Bosa, Von Miller, Gilmore, she takes Von Miller! Woo! 170K, boy, is expensive, just, 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 but he's got edge threat, so. I can confidently say it's worth it. Although, do I actually let him use edge threat? I'm gonna have to take a lot of abilities off the other players. I don't think I'm gonna do it, because I, I've used five AP on Von Miller if I'm gonna use edge threat. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna let him like straight up play linebacker. We have the same challenge that we had before, which is we cannot kick PATs at any point. We're now officially three and two. Let's hop into this next game. Scary Terry, Quinn and Williams, Tremaine Edmonds. We're probably gonna have the exact same overall team if those are his three best. He's gonna start out with a play action. Does he throw B? Oh, that is a good testament for how this game's gonna go. This is another rage quit. <laughs> he just shrugged the tackle. He just shrugged Brian Dawkins. Oh, just barely. Stafford, I can't wait to see Stafford in action. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, got lit up. Barkley? Oh, that was cracked. Yeah, I guess if nobody wants to block the left end, I mean, the only guy who could really stop the play that early, I guess that's fine. Holy shit, dude. Can someone throw me a freaking bone? Go up, Waller. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Oh, he doesn't see it. We're gonna get a block. Yup. Let's go. <laughs> We're gonna use those blocks, baby. Let's go. That almost never happens, dude. The blocking on slip screen is always so questionable. Great start for the boys here. I think I can hit Waller right off the rip. Oh, Waller. Whoa, Bike. whoa, 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 whoa. Stafford? I will in a sec. Oh, he's gonna throw A? RB, maybe? He can't throw shit. What? How the fuck did you just make that throw off your back foot? Ooh. Ooh, we crack Russell Wilson. No fumble. Dude. What is this blocking? Holy shit. Oh my God. Look at Darren Waller. Get to the edge. Oh, actually that's fine. That's perfect clock management right there. I'm gonna try a corner route out of Darren Waller. Let's see if that's there. Kind of sketchy looking. Oh my God. I'm so sick of getting 
absolutely lasered off the edge. That guy didn't even get blocked for a second. McLaurin might be a touchdown. Ah, uh, he saw it. All right, underneath to Barkley, get in there! Let's go! What a beast! 14 seconds on the clock. We definitely need this one though. I'm just gonna run it. Let's go, Barkley. Let's go, Barkley. Oof, that's 14 to 12. That's kind of ugly. We're gonna try tight end attack. Oh my God. Did DK Metcalf just toast his man? Oh my God, and he still caught it. Let's go. One reception for 56 yards. DK, well done, my friend. All right, we're going with the dive. Get into the edge, get in the shoot. Saquon, take over. Take over this game, Saquon. I need you. It's kind of obvious I'm gonna throw Metcalf here. He'll probably try and jump it. Oh, I was didn't even get time to throw it. Whoa. Absolutely nobody guarding McLaurin. Ryan Dawkins does catch him. Got a chance for the goal line stop. He is going to run the ball. Like, feel super confident saying that. He's been dominating me in the run game. Great stop, though. Great stop. Let's get that goal line stop, boys. All right, let's see what he's looking for. going there and I missed the tackle. I went for the interception, which made me miss the tackle. Just gotta hit this gap with Dawkins. Get there! Oh, he dodged it, but he ran right into my guy. Let's go! This is fourth and goal. I have to get a goal line stop at some point today. Oh! Oh, let's go! We stopped the read option! We're on the two, but we got our one stop. Uh-oh. This is gonna be ugly. Alright, Saquon. Yes! Oh my God, he's wide open. Huge catch in front of the safety, let's go. Waller, he's got it, let's go. 12 for 17, 280 and two touchdowns in Stafford's debut, I like that. Oh, yup, big catch and that's a first. Yes, sir. Barkley, Barkley, this is so efficient, let's go. Dude, Barkley's killing him. All right, he sees me messing with Waller. Does he go to it? He does not, that's a target. Laser, let's go! Let's get this two point and end this game. I cannot believe I've been so bad about the two point today, but obviously there's nothing I can do about that right now. Let's go five wide. I have not ran five wide like all game. Wait, I'm so stupid. I thought it was an eight point game. My math is all wrong. Stafford's in! He got in! You're a god, Stafford! You're a god! All right, that is a 12-point ball game. I can confidently say I think it's over. Let's go! Von Miller stays on the squad, and that is a challenge complete. I only went for two, and we're gonna get a pack. Look at the stats, dude. Stafford, 154.4, 16 for 22, 321 yards, 72% completion, and three passing touchdowns. It's Russell Wilson only missed one pass, but he never scored a touchdown. Barkley, four for 26 on the ground. Barkley, nine for 139 in the air. McLaurin four for 95. Waller four for 115. Dude, I'm interested to know how many career yards Waller has. And I can check that now with next gen stats. Four wins and two losses, boys. We got to win three of the next five games to advance the playoffs. Let's see what's in packs today, huh? Kickoff pack is 30K. Clutch pack is 34K. Both of those are not that good. There is a Legends fantasy pack. Oh, there's only 20 hours left on it. Thank God. That's an expensive pack, but completing a challenge gets any pack that you can buy with coins. This obviously counts. Let's see if we can get anything that we need. Oh, I missed that animation. It was probably kind of pretty. All right, nothing special here. This is round two of two. Josh Allen, that actually is pretty good. Dude, that's huge. That's huge. Let's see who our legend is, though. Spruce Matthews. Deion Jones is definitely the pickup. Boys, another massive W. I love you. Thank you for watching. As always, I needed this win so bad. I'll see you in the next episode of Wheel of Mutt. Peace.